what is in that treasure chest. We got a thousand gil. Nice, but I tend to get more during actual fights. Whatever. We have more stairs over here. Well, I get more gil during fights outside Mysidia, not in this dungeon. The inventory is full, can't carry anywhere. Hold on. Okay, and here we have more Thanatos, so we can fear random people. Awesome. So continuing, pretty much the only place we haven't gone yet, which is right through here. Down these stairs to basement 5. We get a sleep scroll, which is awesome. And now, we want to... Oh, yes, we were down there. So let's head toward... Oh, wow. In the middle of the room, there's an obvious boss fight. Let's do it. It is the Guardian of the Black Mask, Gigan Rhino. Wait, Gigan Rhino? Boss? Didn't I already fight one of these things? Like, outside Mysidia? I swear they came in pairs. Okay, everybody just attack it. Game, set, and match. Like I said, I've already fought this as a normal enemy. I don't know, they designed this little part of the game out of order, if you ask me. But in the treasure chest, we get... A black mask, which is what we were here for. Now, yes, there is a teleporter at the back. So now we need to head... Back to Mysidia, I believe. Yeah, well, I'll just meet you back at Mysidia. Um, if you remember, it is the dot over... Well, there. So I'll meet you there. Be right back. Alright, I returned to Mysidia, healed up, and sold some of the stuff that they just gave me in that dungeon because it's not really useful to me. And now we're he ready to move on to our next destination. Are there going to be Gigan Rhinos here? Nope, just bombs. I was about to say, if they gave me Gigan Rhinos again, I'm just going to laugh. Okay, so our next destination is where I originally thought Mysidia was, which is over to the east, this way. What did I say? Two Gigan Rhinos and a Winged Ray. Let's just go ahead and attack them. Is that enough to take out that guy? No. I mean, this is supposed to be a huge difficulty spike from the from the tropical island to Mysidia. Why would they make me come to Mysidia first? You know, you know what I mean? It's just backwards. Finish it off. Thank you, bro. That's definitely enough to finish that guy off. One more rounds of attack should be able to take this guy out. There we go. 1900 gil. I, I just I just don't understand the game sometimes. So we need to head through the marshlands into the forest again and then head west. It looks like there's a destination over here. Well, at least the mountains open up over here. And I don't know if I've showed you guys these guys before. I've shown them in Final Fantasy 1, that's for sure. These are cockatrices. They stone you. Kill them as quickly as you can. Stone is something that I think I've already gone over. Asuna can't cure, so I keep five gold needles with me at all times. Just in case I run into those guys. Or the uh, specters, the blue skeleton kind of looking things. They, uh... They can cast stone on everybody. It's awful. Really? I do see a cave here. This looks like the place we need to go. We need to get that crystal rod in order to complete our quest. Okay, this place looks confusing. I, I already do not like this place. Looks like there's a treasure chest over to the west, though. Are there new enemies here? No. But those specters, those are the ones I was talking about. They can cast stone on everybody. I believe the spell that they use is called Break. Let's grab that treasure chest here. We get a gold hairpin. I don't know what that is, but it was a helmet. I did see that. Oh, well, Luke's already got one, so I should know what it is. 
Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and move that over. You can keep that Titan's Helm, and you can get the other Titan's Helm because you're, you're an attacker. Whereas Loki Nova are kind of mages, so to speak. They're kind of battle mages. We want to go through here, and there is another treasure chest over here. We get a ninja suit. That sounds awesome. Let's get that on Luke, right? Luke wants to be a ninja? Luke wants to be a ninja. And everybody gets an upgrade? Looks like everybody gets an upgrade. Sweet. Because Luke is now a ninja. Alright, let's head out of here. So let's head west. And then, I believe, through this door here. What is through the door? It's a trap. Damn it! Thought that was the right door. Maybe it's further south. So let's continue on. What the hell? Do you guys see what I see? I see an imposter over there. There's only one Luke. The doppelganger is not moving. Luke's good heart is binding its movement. That's because we put the white mask on the, on the statue. So let's go ahead and find that black mask. See, like, it still says the white mask is in our inventory, even though we put it on the, the thing. The black mask was placed over the doppelganger's face. Take that, you dick! I'll show you to pretend to be me. It vanished with the black mask. Alright, so here's the door I was looking for. I believe I want to go north first. Okay, let's head all the way over here to find another treasure chest with a power staff. Which would be awesome if I had somebody that used a staff. But I don't! Now how the hell am I supposed to get that treasure chest? I mean, there's no way in. Unless you go through here! And in this secret treasure chest we get the, the flame lance? Don't we already have one of those? Bro, what you got on? You got the flame lance, that's what I thought. So I guess you could dual wield flame lances if you wanted. I don't really feel like it though. I like the axe combo. Axe spear combo. So let's continue on. What I believe I want to do is go as far west as I can. And then continue south. And I believe this is the door I'm looking for. It is. Okay. Down to basement number three. I believe this is the way I want to go. What the hell? There's another treasure chest that requires a secret entrance. And we get an ice bow. I mean, these are things that I just bought. Damn you, game. Let me enjoy buying things without ruining them by giving them to me in the next dungeon. Let's continue on. Let's go back east. I see a treasure chest. I don't know how to get it, though. So let's try this way. It looks like I did find the way to get it. Nice. I get the ogre killer, but there's a monster. What do we have this time? Bombs! They are weak to fire. We shall burn them with the fire. Let's see if it works. Just a bit. Just a bit. Enough for Luke to finish it off right here. Down goes the last one. Easy enough. These were these were enemies that I was grinding on for for however long I was grinding. Okay, this ogre killer is the same thing that I just forgot. Okay, moving on. Let's continue. Let's get out of this this little lake thing. Ignore that door there and back into the water because. I'd like to watch you guys swim. Okay, it looks like this is the door we are headed for. Be the right door, don't be a trap! Thank you, down to basement four. Looks like this place is flooded too, which is awesome. You guys need to maintain your temples better. Let's go up these stairs, and hopefully we'll find something good on the other side. I do see a treasure chest. I want something good. Big money, big money. No whammies. 
That's a freaking whammy right there. Better been worth it. Damn you. So we get a potion out of that chest, and let's go in the middle one. Oh, right choice. We get the mute bell. Phoenix down. And we got an inventory full. And in the last one, we get a gold needle, which I haven't needed to use in this dungeon yet. Not yet. So let's head through this door here in the corner. Corners are always good for stairs. And at the bottom of these stairs, we find basement number five in the Mystician Cave. We get the drain scroll, which I already bought. And there's a monster inside, so that's awesome. What do we have? I think these are new enemies. Ghosts? It's hard to tell. Hard to tell. Let's let's burn them and show them the light. And hopefully, they will die. I don't know if we've shown holy. I think we have. It does a little bit of damage. Not enough for the victory on any of them. But, oh, these guys are pretty strong. These must be upgrades things we haven't seen before. We did get one of them to go, and then of course whoever bro attacks dies instantly. We should be able to finish these guys off with regular attacks it looks like. So let's go ahead and just finish them off. Down go the ghosts. How much, how much kill? 3300 magic defense increase. Nice. Always good. Always good. Let's head all the way south. All the way to the south, to the east. And then, what do we got here? We have a treasure chest that doesn't look like I should be able to get to. Ah ha ha! Got a mini scroll. Nice. Have the secret chest. What do we have? Potion. Come on, something better. Fine. Better have been worth it. Potion. Potion. And a fight. Give me something better! Potion. Damn you, why'd you give me four potions? So let's go back out through that secret passage. There it is. Couldn't remember where it was. Okay. Looks like our exit is way over there. So we need to take the long, narrow hallway up there. Do you guys see what I see? I see a Ryos. I want him to burn. You must burn for what you did to me before. Burn. It was enough for the kill. He is apparently not weak to fire. He's probably not weak to anything. But he burned nonetheless. I don't care about your stupid eye drops. Have a sooner now. Okay, let's head up. Really? Through this door to find three treasure chests. We get a drain scroll, which I already have, Osmo scroll, which I will need, and the crystal rod. Nice! There's no warp, there's no boss, so let's just get the hell out of here. I'll warp us out. Be right back. With the dungeon out of the way, we need to head back to Mycidia, which I will be doing off screen, and I will meet you guys next time. I hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.